Hi everyone, uh, my name is Andy. Uh, my YouTube channel is uh, Andy Amazon Advocate. Uh, today I have a friend, uh, Nathan. Uh, we are supposed to do this uh, video, uh, I think quite some time ago. <laughs> but um, what happened, there was some uh, restructuring of his uh, company and uh, everything. You know, uh, maybe I can tell you guys more about that later on. But uh, finally, I get to meet him. Okay, long overdue video. And I'm so happy to see you finally. Okay, uh, maybe Nathan, you want to um, introduce yourself, you know, more about yourself first? <music> Yeah, and thanks for having me on. I'm a longtime Amazon seller. I got started uh, back in 2008, so pretty early on before the courses, the gurus, the software, and I scaled that business out of my college dorm room, ended up selling over $25 million over six or seven years, and I, I really scaled the business using virtual assistants. I, I was 20, hiring college kids. They weren't really reliable. Uh, no 30, no real person in the real world wanted to, to work for a college kid, so I got into the remote hiring world, the Upworks, the Fivers. I, I made some good hires, also a lot of bad ones, made a ton of mistakes. And I also just hated the platforms. It took too long to post a job, get 50 people to apply, interview them one by one. And I always wanted something better, something faster. And when I couldn't find it, I built it myself. I, I built the free up marketplace, which originally started just for Amazon sellers to get pre-vetted virtual assistants, freelancers, quick matching, great support on the back end, no turnover protection if someone quits. We eventually moved on to Shopify and Walmart sellers and eventually marketing in general. And we scaled that business from a $5,000 investment to a million, 5 million, 9 million, 12 million in 2019. About halfway through last year, one of our clients reached out to us and they wanted to get into the VA freelancer space. They, they love free up. They didn't want to start it from scratch and they ended up acquiring us. And that's a whole nother story we can talk about if you want. Um, but now that I've helped with that transition, I'm now working on a new venture called Outsource School, where we teach people how to build businesses using virtual assistants, just like I did with the Amazon business and free up, but entirely remote, no office, no US employees, just remote VAs in the Philippines doing all parts of your business. And that's kind of the short story of how I went from a broke college kid to baby products on Amazon, free up it, and now outsource school. So guys, uh, now you know what happened, you know, um, I supposed to uh, interview him uh, when he was uh, in, you know, still in free up. And then there was some transition and I'm very happy, you know, the transition went well. And then uh, now he's, uh, he has this, uh, this outsource school. Okay, wow. This outsource school uh, seems to be fun, and uh, I'm also uh, inside the outsource school. And um, maybe you want to tell us a little bit more about outsource school. You know, what does it do, and etc. Yeah, so when we first sold FreeUp, we had a lot of people reach out to us, say, hey, can you, can you create a course and teach us how you did it, how you interview, how you onboard, how you train, and how you manage people. So that's how we started. We launched this course called Cracking the VA Code, which teaches our exact process of interviewing, onboarding, training, and managing. And luckily, people really liked that course. And we ended up turning it into a membership where if you buy that course, you join Outsource School for the next year, and you get all these courses that we're coming out with included. So how to hire a VA for lead generation, to partner with manufacturers, how to hire VAs to get on more podcasts and grow your brand, how to hire VAs to do your bookkeeping, which we all, we all need. So we're coming out with all these courses taught by us, taught with other experts that know VAs just as well or better than we do, and you get access to all of that by buying Cracking the VA Code, or you can buy the, the mini courses separately if you want. So that's one side of it. And we're building a membership and a community around that, around helping entrepreneurs scale remotely. The same developer that built the free up marketplace, who was part of the buyout, he's now working on an SOP building software. That's a standard operating procedure software that we're really excited about. We think it's going to be a game changer. People are going to be able to make SOPs easier faster, more secure. And we're going to be launching that and having that complement our education. And if that goes well, we have some other ideas for VA software that will launch over the next few years. So that's kind of how Outsource School is coming together, a membership for education plus a software component. Well, I'm so happy to see you, man. I mean, you never stop. You know, most people, maybe they sell off their company. They will like take a vacation in Hawaii. I, I mean, I know you can't go Hawaii now. Can't go anywhere. I'm stuck at home. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, but I, I'm so happy, you know, you just keep on moving and moving. And, and I think there's a spirit of entrepreneurs. Uh, we entrepreneurs never stop, okay? Uh, and I think the day where we stop, I think it's the day where we die. <laughs> okay, um, uh, for, for uh, my fans and for my, um, you know, for my students, uh, I, I think most of my students know that uh, I always recommend free up. So uh, you guys know the link for free up, but if you forget, you can refer to the link below. Oh, I love free up still. I want to add in. I'm now a client of free up, which is a little bit weird. I get all my VAs there. We're actually partnered with them. The new owners are great. The team that I built is still there. We made sure that they were taken care of. We took hundreds of thousands of dollars from a sale and gave it to them. So it, we think it's a win-win for everyone and, and free up is still awesome. Yes, correct. So uh, the link for free up will be below this video. And also for, um, you know, Nathan's uh, outsource school, um, the, the training programs and everything um, is also below this link, uh, this video, there will be the link below. So guys, um, um, okay, maybe, maybe um, Nathan, um, maybe just one last question before we end this uh, interview. You know, with all this craziness going to be go over soon, okay, I'm very sure you're going to be over soon, okay? So for once this pandemic is over and et cetera, you know, where do you think, you know, Amazon sellers will be, uh, you know, what type of new challenges do you think uh, Amazon sellers will be facing? Yeah, I mean, it's tough to predict the future. I think that on the hiring side, people have to reevaluate. Do they really need offices? Do they really need people in person? And I think more and more people are, are going to be hiring remote. I think e-commerce isn't going anywhere. I mean, if anything, more people are going to stay at home. More people are going to order products at home. They're not going to want to go to stores and risk themselves. So I think that's going to help e-commerce. I think with that will become more businesses trying to get into e-commerce and online selling, which is going to make it a little bit more competitive. And, and I'm sure Amazon will have their own changes as well, that stuff that we can't even think of. So I think the world was already going more remote, more towards e-commerce before COVID. I think COVID kind of just sped the whole thing up and it's going to be very interesting to see, it's going to be very interesting to see what the world looks like afterwards. True. Thank you so much. So guys, um, if you want to know um, uh, more about uh, know what he do and about VA and et cetera, and you want to ask, uh, you know, Nathan questions, you can also uh, comment below my video. Okay. And I'll try to uh, ask Nathan for you guys. And I will always do my best to help you reply the questions. Okay. So uh, thank you so much, Nathan, for the interview today. And uh, I'm very happy that I learned a lot of things for you, from, from you. And uh, as a matter of fact, I think that what you say is very true because going forward, I think online, it's going to be the future. And, uh, you know, the last pandemic, you know, um, that's when Alibaba became better. So I think with the, uh, you know, with this pandemic, you know, uh, I'm sure that Amazon sellers will be much better off, even better than ever. And uh, we are, we'll be staying united. And uh, of course, using VA is very important as well. Okay. If Absolutely. You, your business. Okay. Mm -hmm. So thank you so much, Nathan. I hope to see you guys. I'll see you soon again. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.